This is the fourth episode of a new series on my channel called Let's Talk About It, where I answer all of your questions. Super excited about this. I get asked all the time how it is that I price things and what should I add to my tip menu and so forth and so forth. And I had so much fun personally creating my tip menus. I still want to create more tip menus, but I will show you guys how creative you guys can be with your tip menus. I'm also gonna share what it is that I charge for my tip menus. All right, so currently I have one, two, three, four, five tip menus. They're literally right in front of me right now. So the first one is called the main menu and I'm gonna click on it and just kind of go over it with you guys. This is the menu that most people go to when they first uh, go on my share page. And this menu is more stereotypical cam girl tip menus. I have other ones that are a lot more creative that I wanna share with you guys, but really quick, let's just go over main menu and my prices. Cam girls have their own currency tokens. Each token is worth five cents to me, but when a customer buys a token, they pay 10 cents. So when I say 500 tokens is what I charge, the customer pays 50 and I get 25. So um, on my main menu, the first thing that I have on there is private open. I will not do a full erotic show on public chat but I do take private shows. With my private shows, I always demand that the customer turns on their camera. If you're not willing to show me who you are on the other side, then we cannot do a private. Before you do take me into a private, I charge 500 tokens. So they again pay 50 and I get 25. The reason for charging a pre-tip is because you're taking me out of my public chat. I'm gonna end up losing the room for going into a private session with you. And if you happen to be a pain in my ass, and I have to exit the private, then at least my ass is covered for 500 tokens. I also have a Snapchat, a private Snapchat, and I charge 500 for that as well. I charge 150 tokens for flashing, 100 tokens for twerking and spanking, and then I have different wheels. I have a naughty wheel that I have for 150, and then I have my regular wheel that I charge 75 for. I charge 50 tokens for feet, 400 for meow, flash, 120 for licking the nips, 30 tokens for song requests, 20 for blowing kisses, 10 for winking, 1,000 tokens because you love me. People do this. People will tip for this. Make sure that when you're creating your tip menus that you have um, crazy high prices for random things because people will pay it. There might always be somebody that comes into the room and starts like saying, like, eh, who do you think you are? Uh, literally a princess goddess, what are you talking about? because that happens as well. Like people will come in there and try and haggle your prices or make you question why it is that you're charging for these things. But I will tell you that I have been tipped a hundred dollars just because you love me a thousand tokens often. Um, so create things like that on your menu. I also charge 200 tokens, which is $20 to speak to me privately. When I'm streaming, I will not have conversation unless you tip me for that. It is distracting to have many tabs open while you're streaming and I have it set so that you can't just message me unless you have paid the $20 to talk. 300 for C2C, 30 tokens for hair up, 40 tokens for hair down. There is no method to this, you guys. I literally just create things. I, I'm sorry. 50 tokens for the heels on and 60 tokens for the heels off. Armpits is 30 tokens. Song request and dancing to the song is 200 tokens. <laughs> I can't wait to share with you guys Nala's store. By the way, Nala is my spicy name. Rooster uh, rating is uh, 200. Dirty questions are 25. And then brown hole flash is 500 tokens, which is 50 bucks or 25 for myself. So that is my, my main menu. I also do Skype shows and for my Skype shows um, my rates are currently a hundred dollars. They used to be a hundred dollars for 15 minutes but I brought it up to a hundred dollars for 20. I only take cash out for Skype shows so that is what I charge for in your future. I do plan on charging maybe double. always get asked how is it that you you price your things and I, I can't tell you guys how to price your thing. And you literally just decide how much your things cost and just stick to your prices because people will pay it. You'll get people that will try and, you know, haggle you or ask you why, who, who do you think you are again? Because I got that one, like, who do you think you are? Like, skirt, a literal goddess. Now, let me share with you guys what I have on Nala's store. All right, so for panties, I charge 
thousand tokens. That is two hundred dollars, and then I get one hundred dollars for bathwater. I charge four hundred tokens, which is forty dollars, and I get twenty. Used high heels. I charge four thousand tokens. That is four hundred dollars, and I get two hundred. For socks, I charge one thousand tokens. That is. $100 for them and $50 for myself. So that is Nala Store. I really love Nala Store. I will actually be making some type of merch to add on Nala Store. I know that maybe my prices might seem high for some people, but if uh, you can't afford it, that's a you problem. Um, my things do get purchased sometimes for more than what I have uh, listed. So especially if they decide they, that, that they want to cash at me versus uh, use the token currency because a lot of people are aware that they do take a huge cut of your money. This is another one of my favorite. This is my offline tip menu. This is for people that come to see me often and typically this comes from people that you have built some type of a connection relationship with or something like that. So an offline tip menu is when a client goes online and sees that you are not online and I have things for them to treat me and people use this one all the time and I get super excited when they do when they do the offline tip menus. So I have Starbucks and for Starbucks I charge 150 tokens. Brunch is 600 tokens. Wine and dine me is 1,000 tokens. Pedicure is 1,000 tokens. Massage is 2,000 tokens. People will absolutely pay to pamper you. And I just love this menu so much. Um, I really, really recommend an offline tip menu because if you're not online and they're thinking about you, you will be surprised how much these people appreciate you and will support you financially. Don't worry about the people that are like, oh my god, like who do you think you are? Why are you charging these prices? I'm not worried about you. I'm obviously not in your cam girl budget. Go find something else. You would not go into a Chanel store and start complaining to the people that work there that you can go to Target and get a $30 bag. Now we're gonna go into my silly tip menu. My silly tip menu um, is for people that don't have a lot of money. And I wanted to create a menu for people that still want to help me, but don't have a lot to give. So let's go through the silly tip menu. <laughs> Sorry, I'm laughing already. It's silly, like I said, uh, it's bark. It's 30 tokens, 30 tokens for barking. Per and meow. I'll do this one for free for you guys because it's literally one of my favorite things to do. That is 25 tokens. Wink with both eyes, 10 tokens. One chair spin, like this. Uh, that is uh, 10 tokens. Three chair spins with boobs out is 75 tokens. And then lick elbow is 25 tokens. This is a really fun and obviously very like interactive tip menu that again, if you don't have a lot, I still appreciate you. If you only wanna give me 50 cents, I'll take it and I'll do a chair spin. So now my most favorite tip menu. This one really pisses some people off, but STG, others, more important people will actually pay it. These are basically just compliments. These are uh, tokens just because you love me, okay? They do love me. A hundred tokens to say I'm a pretty girl. So they'll send 100 tokens and there'll be like a note that says pretty girl. You're cute, 200 tokens. Nice butt, 200 tokens. Nice titties, 400 tokens. <laughs> I love your hair, 30 tokens. I love your smile, 50 tokens. I love your lips, 50 tokens. Because I love you, again, we already did the because I love you, but I have it on this menu too. 1,000 tokens, $100, just because you love me. And they will literally do it. Some of them watch my channel. I love you guys too. Princess is 500 tokens. $50, just call me princess. Queen, I'm a queen. 600 tokens. People really like that one. I get cashed out just to be a queen or a goddess or a mommy. Oh, I need to add mommy on here. Goddess, 700 tokens. And then be mine, 10,000 tokens. Nobody's done that one yet. <laughs> but they will it, it will eventually get clicked on so those are the only tip menus that i currently have i need to create more i have so much fun making them and i'm always so flattered when people go on there and purchase things off of there so yes you guys can literally do anything some girls do jumping jacks my boobs are way too big for that squats like 
I, I don't know. Like you can get as creative as you want and you can set your prices however you want to. So just keep that in mind when you're creating your tip menu. Have as much fun as you possibly can. I would love to hear what you guys have on your tip menu. If you go, if you want to comment that below, what is your favorite tip menu item or command that you have? Share them with me. I'm super interested.